like you were talking a little bit about artists like trying to come out as a different sexuality oh. and they wanting that to get them to the top oh, and yeah. fame. So I'll let you take over this. No, no, it, it's just been driving me crazy lately with the whole Lil Nas X thing. And now all of a sudden, everybody that wants to be, you know, get straight to the top, they talking about they gay or something about their sexuality. I'm like, is that the new road to stardom? Mm -hmm. Like, why is it now it's okay for everybody to come out, all these hip hop artists now say, oh, I'm this, I'm that, because of Lil Nas X. I, I don't understand, like, what is that about? Is so it about- So did you see a pattern after- Yeah, I see a pattern. Thing? And I'm like, is I, it about I, I, your sexuality or is it about being a star? Yeah. I've kind of seen a pattern before that because really, um, Sexuality and all that has become so prevalent within the culture. Mm -hmm. You know, everything is, it, it, we have to be so careful when we talk about uh, gay people. We have to be so careful. You know, anybody says anything gay or, or kind of on that tone, all of a sudden their show is off, they're getting cut off, mm -hmm. they're getting this. So the powers that be were kind of trending that way. And with, with us being in Atlanta too, yeah. you know. It's, it's prevalent out here, so yeah. But 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 the point of it was like, okay, remember when everybody wanted to be under wraps or DL or whatever? Right, nobody right, wanted right. to come out. Now everybody just because rainbows it's, it's and glittering. Like, yeah. what's that about? And I think it had a lot to do with them legalizing same-sex marriage, and then after that, it seemed like every show that you watch has to have some type of gay representation because if not then That's there is that exactly exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. you can't watch anything nowadays without some of that matter say, right, being okay. in it so right. i definitely think that they've made it a, a big, it's big become deal. part of mainstream it, it, it has, you know, it has. but i just feel like it's a hit on future and young young the young our young our youth yeah because when it comes to starting strong families mm -hmm. you can't start strong families with that with that whole era with what era with the the lg okay now we're going to the other direction <laughs> so what i'm saying what, no i get what, what you're saying, saying is it, when, when it comes to that um even when it comes to it's exploiting this to make it more mainstream so more people right. can see it and it can carry on and on and but on. But everybody on. Which is that's fine. Everybody I know, that's so fine. You still don't have your families, you still don't have this. I'm just trying to figure out Let why. Let me ask one question then. If everybody was, and I'm just using this hypothetically, if everybody was gay or were, were, were not heterosexual, then how, how would they reproduce? But that's the, we're not talking about that. I'm talking about using gay to become famous. Right. I'm thinking that's going to bring them more notoriety. I'm not, I'm sure everybody ain't going to be one way where we can't have kids no more. That don't make no, sense. No, no. I'm not saying it makes sense, but I'm saying that part of it is exploiting. So you it's, think that's it's, making people... If, 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 if you saying, hey, it's okay to be gay. Do it make you gay? Do it no, make you gay? Hell yeah, no. So what saying. difference do you right. think? Uh, no, so what you saying is you saying. training that from kids. Kids. Like, it's it like, oh, it, okay. now it's okay yeah, yeah, to okay. be it. And, and it's okay. So you saying it's not okay? No, no, no. What I'm saying is it's not okay to put, put those thoughts or beliefs onto a child who should go through yeah, life you and learn it. And you're using you like superstars to do it. So if you superstars are, are but, that, and that's what they're exploiting, because okay. there are a lot of people that have the same amount of talent that are not being exploited. But if, if you're saying not to put it on somebody, that means people are still not being who they naturally are, because you don't want this kid to think you no, to no, be this no. way. Well, what are you saying? I'm saying that it's being more magnified now. That's all. So okay. it's easier to, to come out the closet or be that way, and it's exploit. It's not. I, I feel this is the easiest time to come out of the closet. It know? is. It, it, it in is. my lifetime, it's as far as it right, is. right, it's just become part of mainstream, part of part, part right. of the culture. Like you said, every show now has to have you know. And to me, it kind of it, it, it takes away from. It's kind of some. I feel sometimes it's kind of some heterosexual bashing. I, I, I just kind of put the other way now. People be mad. You heard about yeah. it? I just saw this on in, on Instagram. A, a gay gang straight bashed some people with they pistol whipped them dudes in like panties and shit. I'm like, this, is, this is some crazy stuff That's a gay gang just big just straight bashed so it's hard being here so it's hard being straight these days i i i um i look at what happened to terry cruz okay 
This dude is huge, like a big muscle bound. He used to be in the NFL, bodybuilder, <laughs> bodybuilder, all of that. Like the 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 antithesis of what you think black men's masculinity would be. And you know, some white rich Hollywood man, Gravis, Gravis Johnson, dog like it's okay at a party, like. Hey. And my thing with Terry Crews is you can tell he's very in tune with his emotions. He cries a lot. I've watched so many, and not to say that's a bad thing, but for someone to do that to him and and really just violate his whole person and then when he's talking about it, he's getting emotional, you know, he's just not that type of man. Right. He may be big, he may be, you know, he may look like well, you're this. You're not the type of dude exactly. that will turn around and he's punch not. the ball. He's, he's not. not. Right. He's but, not. But, but you, like, the fact that, you know, like, the casting couch, you know, Lil Nas X, you know, he's out now, but the casting couch has been real funny for years. Yep. You know what I mean? Like for people who are trying to get on or, or whatever. You know, heard the story. It's, 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 you, know, yes. you know, and, and, and it's unfortunate because I don't think everybody that partakes in it's some of these activities are right. Right. even like they just want their life to change. Right. right. And so it's unfortunate that, you know, you know, it, it, it happens that way, but some people gotta just be true to who they are. Be who you are. And they gotta know who they are and, and know their identity and know who they are. And be comfortable with it. And be comfortable with it. It's okay. It's okay.